Brandon Schumacher with Citadel Defense. The last data I knew, and uh, you can correct me if, if you got more recent data or if you know, is that 2% uh, of the general male adult population is qualified into the area of psychopath sociopath, like the psychopath socio sociopathic uh, tendencies, right? And in that bracket, not all of them, obviously, um, but but in that bracket is where you get the real like serial killer types and and sadistic torture murder types and and, and things of that nature. So thankfully, it's not very uh, common. However, of course, that these these people do exist, right? And I made a point while teaching a class the other day, and then I want to share that point with you, which is this. Uh, never, ever, 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 under any circumstances, including the threat of your life, or the life of your kids, or the life of anyone else that you're with, go with someone to a secondary crime scene. Okay? So what that is, is that's like, you know, hey, you come with me right now or I'm going to shoot you. Make them shoot you uh, because anything where someone wants to get you away into a private location is going to be really really bad that's like what I'm talking about the sadistic torture murder uh, the the really bad sexual assaults the child molestation anything that happens with a kidnapping um, outside of the ransom kidnappings which I feel like is a different deal here is really really bad and you don't want any part of that uh, because when you go with them there thinking, oh, if I go with them, maybe I will live, most likely you will not. Uh, and it will get much worse for you before the end. So tell your tell your kids that, tell your wife that, tell your husband that, any, anybody you know in your life, right? You need to make sure they know that under no circumstances ever are you to willingly go with someone to that secondary crime scene. You need to fight with everything you have which preferably and better be your gun on your person and make sure you tell your kids they need to fight, kick, scream, bite, yell, shout, tear clothes, gouge eyes, they need to do everything they can to not go with that person because again anything that happens there is going to be really bad and you don't want any part of. Uh, so I, I think that's fairly common advice and I think we all know that but maybe we don't so maybe there's someone in your life who doesn't know this, let them know, send them this video. So make sure that you never, ever, 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 under any circumstances, ever, even if they're threatening, if, you, if you're out with you and your three kids, and they're threatening all of you, and they're just going to kill you all right there, let them. That's a better way to go. Never go to a secondary crime scene. Do brave deeds and endure.